birthday. In 2004, a beautiful bouncing baby girl was born. Her proud and happy parents, Jason and Marisol, named their second born child, Marian Salvador Westlake. As a little girl, lovely, beautiful in her own self, Miss Marian Westlake, escorted by Dylan Matos. At this point, I would like to call Anna. Let, let us all stand up. Oh. Make sure you stand up for a long time because, you know, very long. <laughs> okay. We really love Let us put ourselves in the presence of the Lord, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Mm -hmm. Amen. Lord our God, we dedicate this very special day to you, 
for it is you who gave us the most wonderful gift, Marian, a loving daughter, a cousin, and a friend. May you continue to shower her with blessings and keep her on the right path so that she may realize all her dreams and remain humble, God-fearing and responsible young adult. Bless also her family and all, those, and all those who are gathered here tonight. We also pray for those who aren't here with us. Lord, be our silent guest tonight as we celebrate Marian's 18th birthday. Be with us, O Lord, and bless everybody who made this event possible. All this we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. And blessings for the food.
so much to be proud of. You're so loved by your family and through knowing your mom, your dad, your brother, and aunt. You've been so blessed to be surrounded by genuine hearted individuals and the fruits of their labor have definitely paid off. We see that today. The reward is how you have shined through every step of the way and now it's your time to soar. I never had a debut myself, so when I was writing this speech, I tried to think about what was something, what was something I would want to know when I was 18 and what would I want to tell Marianne today? So this is what I'd like you to know. I'd like you to dream big, don't be afraid to take any risks, and your only limitations are the ones that you set. I want you to be adventurous, don't be afraid to try new things, and growth comes from places of discomfort and never from a place of certainty. Keep your loved ones close. Everyone in this room is here to celebrate you, and remember to always love fully and deeply. Happy birthday, Marianne. May you be gifted with life's biggest joys and never-ending bliss. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. I have known you for years now, and I have to say you're a unique, lovable, and chill person. Really chill. I wish you a very happy birthday and many more decades to come. And um, 18 is a very exciting number, but it can be scary at the same time. But I know you've got this girl. Just be yourself, and you'll be fine. So happy birthday, and don't forget to smile. <laughs> After many years of you know, phases, different hair colors, late night therapy sessions, and a lot of long walks, you can finally relate to that one police song. We've always talked about what life as adults would be like, and now your time is finally here. After so many years of having gone through everything together, elementary school, high school, all the drama and friend groups, you've been my best friend through it all. No matter how big or how small my problems are, you'll always listen to five of the 17 voice messages I send you, and you'll gladly do it the very next day. I'm so proud of the beautiful, kind person you've become, and the new exciting adventures that await you in your new journey to adulthood. 
I hope to receive as many voice messages as I've sent you. I love you and I wish you the happiest of birthdays. When you were about two or three, you would always follow me and your brother around because you always wanted to do whatever we were doing. I remember having to chase you around the apartment in circles because you had so much energy. Fast forward a few years, we started school, and I would be picking you and Emerson up at the end of the day so we can ride the school bus together. A few years later, I was grade 8, and you were grade 2, and our classes were being reading buttons. I don't know how, but I finessed my way into allowing our teachers to let us become partners. You probably don't remember this, but we would just stand by the books really fast and spend the rest of the time talking, and whenever a teacher would walk by, we would just pretend we were reading together. Um, years later, you were grade 8, and you asked me to be your confirmation sponsor. Throughout, the, throughout your high school years, I remember we would go on walks to the park together, go to Starbucks and sit there for a few hours and just talk. Uh, now you're graduating in high school, and it feels like time has gone by really fast. Um, with me being the oldest in our cousin group, and you being the youngest, I've watched you grow into the amazing woman you are today. I'm sure if Maria and the Francis can agree with me here that we always have this feeling of wanting to protect you because you're the baby of the group. Although you're like way taller than the three of us. <laughs> um, but we see that you're growing up and becoming your own person and just know that we're always here for you no matter what and we want nothing but the best for you. Thank you. Happy birthday, Marion. You're 18 now. I met Marion when she was first born too. 18 years ago, <laughs> and such. We, I will say, I'm freestyling this, so bear with me. We are, you know, the five of us, you, me, Francis, Ariana, your brother, we're all five strong cousins that like to protect each other, like Ariana said. We like to be together, we like to hang out together, and it's just been a crazy journey seeing you grow from this small little kid drawing around the walls to drawing on your art and actually making art work. That's very beautiful, y'all have never seen it. And now you're just a very young, talented woman. She's grown, and now she can order her own junior chicken nuggets, like before I used to order for her. And now uh, she can order her own. And, and What? And now she gets a big Mac at McDonald's. With a student discount. <laughs> Uh, what else would I wish you? I wish you lots of prosperous, um, a great prosperous success. I wish you lots of, I wish you to follow your dreams. Make sure you take all the risks you can, even though you think you're, even though you think life's hard and you want to give up, you know, just keep going. Because it's not as hard as you think when you keep going through it. And what else can I say? Happy birthday. <laughs> 18 more years of, Whatever else, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Love you. <laughs> hey, big <A. laughs> So, if you don't know, we have Francis. I'm Mary's favorite cousin. Just kidding, just kidding. No, it's true. It's true. It's true. It's true. It's true. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, Mary is the youngest of our cousins here, so it's really weird to think that she's no longer a little kid anymore that we have to protect. Um, and even though uh, I am older than her, there's a lot of valuable things. Uh, for one, there's always a joke that she can make no matter how serious the situation is, which is good and bad, because we can laugh in situations we shouldn't be laughing at, but it's really nice that I have someone who can make anything really lighthearted, so I really appreciate you for that. Um, Marion also taught me that small acts of kindness go a long way, more than we notice. Um, a lot of things she does, I have inhabited myself, such as just asking people if they're okay, checking up on people, you never really know what people are going through. Um, offering to pay for Starbucks, even though he told you you don't have to pay, just wait till you get a job first. And <laughs> lots, lots of small things that really amount to a lot when you realize how much love and care you have for so many people. And you can tell by the way you treat people, the way the friends all you have, everyone, I feel like, knows that like, you're really good at making people feel appreciated. We've had a lot of good times, a lot of bad times, each other at our best and our worst. But one thing that I've always 
you know, is that no matter how far we distant from each other, no matter how many different stages we're at in our life, no matter what embarrassing phase we're at, which we will not name, the same love will always be there for you, and I'll always have that same love for you. So, um, yeah. Happy birthday! Happy birthday! I can beat those speeches, right? But anyway, Marianini, I called her uh, Marianini. On behalf of all our family members here in Canada and in the Philippines, we would like to greet you a very, very fabulous, wonderful, and great birthday. Um, may all your wishes and dreams in life come true. Keep a big and reaching for the big star. Um, God bless you, and looking forward to celebrating more birthdays with you and the whole family and all your friends. Happy, healthy, and blessed ones. Happy, happy eighth birthday. We love you very, very much. Thank you. You won. The first question for you, and if you the iPhones, we will get a prize.
that was a oh, that would be a fun Now the final game is one you probably already know, and it's called Musical Chairs. Oh. Right. Uh, happy birthday. Yeah, that's all, but yeah. <laughs> Anybody? Dylan? Yeah. You didn't go there though. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, thank you for being a part of my life and I hope to spend many more years with you. Happy birthday. <laughs> okay, um, why are you looking at me like that? I haven't even started yet. Um, I know we've only known each other for around two years, but I have to say you are one of, if not the, worst thing that has ever happened to me. <laughs> but the food's pretty good, so happy birthday. Thank you, thank you. Happiest birthday, Marianne. Uh, I'm a proud of you for the woman you have become, and I'm happy to be with you today in your special day. Wishing you all the best this year and the years to come. Happy birthday! watch TV, or I watch TV, and we sit on the floor, and she's drawing something, and drawing something, and I'm watching King of the Hill, I'll never forget it, and she's drawing, and talking, and drawing, and talking, and I'm paying no attention to her, and finally she's like, that's what I drew, I don't remember how old she was, but I looked down, and I'm like, wow, that's really good, but really weird, and that's when I realized she was a good artist too, so, Aww. that's it, Aww. my little girl. <laughs> She gets her looks and her personality and her sense of humor from me, so I'm sorry, Mary. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, um, Jason. At this point, I would like to call on our lovely debutant to give us a few words. Hello? Okay. Hi everyone. Hello. Hi. So, okay. Firstly, 
Um, I just want to say thank you to everyone for making the time to come over and celebrate my birthday. It means a lot to me, so thank you all. Um, I also want to thank everyone who took the time to set up today with decorations or with like getting food for me, like Tita Bell, Tita Nua, or Jemelin. Um, and I also want to thank all the participants who had to awkwardly dance with me or prepare a speech for me. Thank you guys. Um, yeah. Also, uh, thank you, Eden Gina, for the cake. That looks great. I love it. Um, and the last person I really want to thank is my mom. <laughs> 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 making all the decorations, like that big moon and a lot of things around here. Um, she put a lot of time and effort into making, or fulfilling my alien party desires. So thank you for making this night so special, everyone. Um, I love you all. Thanks, Marion. Ha ha ha!